Well, hello everyone, it's me, Christine, again. <laughs> Welcome to the darkness. I'm not sure if you heard, but in Ottawa, where I live, uh, we were hit by a tornado. <laughs> First of all, I'm okay, everyone here is okay, and my house is fine and not damaged. But as a result of the tornado, there's a couple hundred thousand people in Ottawa without power, <laughs> including this girl. <laughs> a life without power. <sighs> I'm dying. First world problems, a check. And so that's why I wasn't able to upload a video on Saturday because I couldn't edit without power. But in tough times, we must simply survive. And you know what? I need to paint my nails, regardless of whether there's power or not. <laughs> so I thought, since we have no lights, maybe it would be fun to paint my nails in the dark with you guys and answer a couple questions while we're at it. Silver candlelight, how romantic. Hello. It's so quiet in here without anything running. It's kind of scary. I feel like a witch is gonna pop up out of nowhere. <laughs> man! Man! Hey girl. There's no tea, is there? There's no tea today, There's I'm no sorry. Tea. <laughs> it was a dark and stormy night. <laughs> I know we're kind of being jokey about this. I'm not sure if you guys saw the news, but in Ottawa and the surrounding Ottawa, and even in parts of Quebec, there was a tornado that actually touched down and some homes and businesses were destroyed. I saw lots of flooding too, as well as the results of heavy rains and windstorms. So there's some people who aren't doing so well. We're okay, we were in a pocket of Ottawa that didn't get affected by the tornado except for loss of power. The cats are okay. <laughs> Yay, we're okay. We don't even notice that the power is out. <laughs> and man, she's okay. She's just sniffing around somewhere. Your food's gonna go bad in the fridge. I hate you, mom. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna give you a little slap in the dark. Ben thought it would be fun. This was Ben's idea. Was it? To read auto populated <laughs> questions on Google. This is what YouTubers do when they can't think of new content for the week. This is an exceptional circumstance, Ben! <laughs> Alright, I guess Christine's gonna paint her nails and we're gonna look up the most searched questions on the internet about Simply Nailogical. That was the sound of magic. <laughs> Charge the phones. That's the sound of having 50% of your battery left. And we have no idea when we're gonna get our power back. Yep, we're dying, like I said. <laughs> uh, I'm dying, I'm such a YouTuber. Just to give people a sense of what we're working with here. Can't see very well. <laughs> Got a vlog cam over there. The little battery powered light attachment, so that helps. And the sun hasn't completely set, so we have a little bit of light coming from the outside. I don't think I've ever experienced a tornado. I don't know if we've ever had a tornado. It's not common where we are. I mean, like natural disasters in general. We typically don't have to worry about that sort no. of thing, right? Yeah, earthquakes? What's that? Hurricanes? Don't know her. Tornadoes? Get the f*** out of here! <laughs> what are you doing here? It wasn't a very good peel today, was it? No, it wasn't, because... The universe hates me right now. <laughs> that must be it. Awful peel porn. I'm glad you didn't see it. <laughs> Alright, first question. Is Simply Nailogical? Dead. Almost. <laughs> Is Simply Nailogical married? That's the <laughs> that's, first one? That's the first one. The <laughs> What's the answer? <laughs> I think you're supposed to know. And the results say... <laughs> dun, 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 dun. You no. are not the father. Wait. Left hand, right? Is the hand what? a marriage? I don't know. I don't know why people give any shits. <laughs> like, I don't care. What, what does it even mean anymore? It means f all in Canada. We already got healthcare and benefits and shit. <laughs> yeah, if you're not religious, I don't really know why marriage really matters anymore. Although in some states, if you're not married to someone, it kind of, like, you know, yeah. if they're sick in the hospital, a hospital might not let you see them. Like, th there are some antiquated reasons why being married to someone is different than just being common law. In the states. But in Canada, common law is, like, treated the same as married people. Yeah, pretty much. This is my common law partner, Ben. <laughs> okay, next question. Alright, next one. Is Simply Nailogical bisexual? What? Have you ever done something in a video to imply that you were bisexual? I would have suspected that it would say, is Simply Nailogical holosexual? <laughs> Where is that question? Maybe maybe people heard you say, hey, say you're holosexual and they just have no idea what the f you're so talking about. So they think about. it's bisexual. <laughs> the answer is, I am holosexual. <laughs> is Simply Nailogical vegan? Is tea vegan? <laughs> 
tea, I think tea is Well, vegan. I put milk in my tea, so no. Yes. Well, you mostly drink almond milk, right? Yeah, but not in green tea. It has to be regular milk. It's a rule. Isn't it weird that you even put milk in green tea? Yeah, the British hate me. Menti! Oh, Hello. Menti, are you scared of the dog? It's okay. Everything's Aww. okay. I'm actually married to Menchi. <laughs> and it's illegal to be married to two people at once. <laughs> people. Are you doing both hands? Yeah, I know. It's crazy. <laughs> Don't worry. They're going to be different. Wild. Does simply neological have a job? YouTuber's so. a job. No, she's unemployed. Christine got fired for painting her nails in the office, actually. <laughs> Imagine. I think what people mean when they ask that question is do I have a job outside of YouTube? It's just like that's too confusing to auto populate for Google. And the answer is yes! I work as a crime statistics analyst for the Canadian government. That's classified. Yeah, no, don't it's, tell it's it. It's not, it's public <laughs> knowledge. And so does Ben. We have the same job. Look at that, yeah. life partner goals. These two parts of our lives are so different, right? Like we go into this office job and have like, you know, meetings about budgets and analytical plans and releases. And then, you know, we come home and we have conversations about whether or not you're gonna like eat nail polish for views. I did that once. <laughs> yeah, I remember. I heard someone will come up to me at work and be like, I, I heard you're really into bananas. <laughs> we live two very different lives, a double life, I should say. All right, next one. Does Simply Neological live in Ottawa? Yes, and uh, there's no power in Ottawa. <laughs> yeah, I think that's been established. Does Simply Neological smoke? Smoke what? <laughs> smoke, smoke a blow, a, Joe. Smoke a blow, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think they just assume you smoke because you act like you're on drugs? <laughs> Maybe they just think like there must be something wrong with me. I'm using the cell phone to give internet to the computer, but I'm keep losing service. So I'm having trouble even getting these questions. Oh. We're dying, Ben. <laughs> Which nail polish should I pick? Menchi, are you looking at your bed? <laughs> Menchi. All right, ready for another? I need to see if the base coat's dry. <laughs> it's really hard. And simply nail logical. Dance. Speak French. <gasps> oui, c'est vrai, je peux parler français. Oh, oh la la. Oui, je parle français. J'ai allé à l'immersion en français depuis la première ou deuxième année. Mais ça fait longtemps depuis que je parle français à chaque jour. Donc, mon accent est dans la poubelle. So Christine took French classes all the way through grade school to high school, but it's been a long time since she used it on a daily basis, so her French skills are in the garbage. <laughs> I want a croissant. 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 Oh. I can't roll my R's. Oh. T'es pas canadienne. Oh. <laughs> Allez-y, déménagez aux États-Unis. <laughs> All right, and now I'm gonna paint my other hand first with a rose gold polish. It's rose gold. You just have to trust me. <laughs> Why does simply nail logical? Act so crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Why does simply nail logical hate BuzzFeed? <laughs> That's the first one? <laughs> it was only two videos where I was deliberately hating on BuzzFeed <laughs> as a joke. Yeah, when they went out of their way to point out that they that filmed, filmed some... a video before or I filmed the video. Anyways, no, I don't hate BuzzFeed. What else do I hate? <laughs> Why does Simply Neological have yellow nails? Because she's dying because there's no power. <laughs> is it because you also smoke? <laughs> oh, is that why they ask Maybe why that's smoke? why they ask if you smoke. Oh my god, then I really need to clarify that no, I don't smoke cigarettes. <laughs> you paint your nails a lot with pigmented nail polish. Then your nails will get stained over time. It's just like a yeah. fact. They used to be, I think you used to paint your nails like every day. So your nails used to be like this, almost like bright orange candy corn color. But yeah, my nails are yellow, not because I'm dying, but because I paint my nails a lot with really pigmented colors and that's all there is really to it, which is why I made a video a long time ago called Yellow Nails Don't Matter. <laughs> it's a classic. It's so quiet in here. I'm not sure if it's turning up on camera, but you can hear Menchi licking the bed. I should probably be careful because nail polish is flammable. <laughs> so it's yeah, actual. should be careful right now. I see we're preserving the flashlight for when it's most needed. Very important business. Now I'm gonna add some unicorn skins. How much does Simply Neological make a year? <laughs> that is the first one. Is it? This is a weird thing as a YouTuber, right? Knowing that people are Googling how much, money how, you make. How much financial success you have, right? I mean, I don't think we would ever pretend that this hasn't been extremely lucrative and we are super appreciative 
of everything yeah. that has come of Christine making YouTube videos. And the fact that we have been able to do cool things like, you know, donate a lot of money to cat charities or pay, you for, know, pay for people's tuition. We can only do those things because, because of we have you guys. done very well <laughs> by posting YouTube videos. Who knew? But to answer the question. That's for uh, us and uh, the, tax the tax man, man to know. <laughs> I think I bought someone a house or two with, <laughs> with the taxes we paid. <laughs> But I'm not complaining. Not complaining. We no. Don't. All right, next question. I want to know what the answers are, though. I've Googled this before just to see what comes up too, right? And it leads to people who've made videos where they sort of guess based on your views. There's certain websites that a lot of people use that give you a very wide range, but give you a pretty good idea of what the YouTubers you watch could be making. You know what I want to know? How come no one's asking how much I make at my job? <laughs> <laughs> well, this is public knowledge, right? Anyone who works for the federal government. Oh yeah. So, the truth is, I make more on YouTube than my day job. <laughs> there, there's some tea. There you go. <laughs> I don't have tea. Also, it makes me think, I'm not familiar with everyone's situation, but when I see really big YouTubers complaining when like a couple of their videos are demonetized and they make it sound like they can't eat, they can't you know, afford things because of that. I think those people are probably full of shit. Yeah. If you're getting, you know, tens of millions of views a month, if most of your videos are still having ads on them, you're making way more money than most people working. Not to say there isn't a problem with demonetization, yeah, right? Yeah, that's like, not what we're saying. You see people like Mikey Glamengore, who's having like makeup tutorials demonetized for pretty much no reason, just because YouTube is having a hard time telling the difference between actual gore and simulated gore. And guys like Philip DeFranco, who are trying to talk mm -hmm. about like real current events and news issues, and because they're controversial topics, his videos are all just getting flagged. That's a problem, and I feel like this is just growing pains of a platform that is, you know, accepting any sort of user-generated content, but now has become like the main platform for people to watch any sort of video on the internet. While I feel that sometimes demonetization is unfair, because I, maybe the guidelines weren't clearly articulated, which is a problem. They should be clear so you know whether or not the content you're putting up is going to be flagged. I still feel like sometimes YouTubers express their frustration as if they had a right to ads and a right to a certain level of income because they've been getting it last month. The reality is when you become a YouTuber, you signed no contract that said that YouTube is gonna pay you for the next five years at this salary or anything. There is nothing, they owe you nothing. If they decide to like turn off all ads, they can. Yeah. And you signed up for this knowing, or you should remember, that that could happen at any time. Yeah, it's true. That's the hard truth, real tea. <laughs> yeah. So there is little to no job security being a YouTuber. That is a fact. Oh, by the way, I'm starting my <laughs> other hand. All right. How much does Simply Neological wait? Wait? What am I waiting for? The peel off base coat to dry? <sighs> I mean, I guess that's something anyone who's the least bit famous kind of has to go through, right? They think I'm a model. <laughs> that's what it is, right? <laughs> Guys, I'm not a model. <laughs> Next question. What does Simply Neological do for a living? We've already answered that. What does Simply Neological get at Starbucks? <laughs> really? I don't know, Ben, what do I get? Why don't you answer? <laughs> well, it used to be chai tea lattes yeah. all the time. Lately, it's been Earl Grey tea lattes. London fog without yeah. the vanilla. Yeah, <laughs> and always with almond, almond milk, milk these days. Not because I'm allergic to milk, but because I like the taste of almond milk better as a tea latte. <laughs> What's a song we could sing? I can see clearly now the candle's on. <laughs> you turn the candle on? We got no power, we all gonna die. It's alright, right, right. It's a tea sandwich, <laughs> babe. There's no tea here. What? Who are you in the dark? the dark, I try. <laughs> oh, please don't sing that anymore. I have questions for you. The internet has questions <laughs> for me. Not many more. I don't think you're famous enough. Did Simply Neological die in the power outage? <laughs> work at BuzzFeed. <laughs> what? Is that what you really think of me? <laughs> anyway, no. 
Uh, Christine has never worked at BuzzFeed. And I don't think she'd be welcome at BuzzFeed. <laughs> Did Simply Nail Logical break up with Ben? What? They're just waiting for a breakup video. That video would get a lot of views, you know? Well, I made a breakup video once when my nail broke. All right, where am I? No, baby? we didn't break up. Ah. How else would I get my tea? <laughs> Post me. All right, now it's time to add a nice thick coat of glossy taco. All right, let's end with one more question. Then. So it looks like the most common search thing on Google is, can Simply Nail Logical take Ben on a vacation? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> this is like a vacation. Vacation from civilization. Actually, you know what's interesting? With all the power out, people have been sort of like leaving the house and like meeting their neighbors for the first time. Yeah, it's awful. <laughs> it's the worst. People want to answer this question though. When are we going no, on vacation? You want an answer to this question. Well, yeah. So the secret is we do have a vacation planned. <gasps> Ooh. So sometime between now and the end of the year, you'll be hearing something about that. Pause for celebration. Okay, so I'm not sure when this video is going to end up going up because we have to figure out how to edit it just on a laptop. And normally I use a computer with giant hard drives that will not turn on right now. We don't have internet, so we have to find a Wi-Fi somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> to even upload this video. Either we figure out a creative way of getting this online, or if you're seeing this, we have power again. <laughs> we have to make contact with the world again. Is anyone out there? Hello? We're losing daylight. The zombies are coming then. Is anyone out there? Comment down below to let us know that you hear us. <laughs> Power's supposed to be out in Ottawa for a few days. This is already day two. Yeah. We may not survive. Two days without power and we're already this like <laughs> wondering what the hell we're gonna do. Someone send supplies. I'm out of Fiji water. Tati! Tati, can you hear me? Okay. My nails are snatched and I got no place to go. <laughs> hey, it doesn't look so bad in this lighting. What's on my other hand? It's rose gold with you, <laughs> and this was the worst quality nail tutorial ever uploaded to Simply <laughs> Nailogical. <laughs> All right, everybody. Thanks so much for watching, and we'll see y'all later if we have power. <laughs> Bye! <laughs>